Hey everyone, in this NBA 2K24 how to do a floater video, I'm gonna show you exactly that. I'm also gonna show you where you go to practice it. So a floater looks like this, and there is a floater. So what am I doing, how does it work? You can see on the video up the top left-hand side there, I'm moving the left stick forward to get close range. So this is close range when we're in the paint here. Uh, and then all we're doing is we're holding down on the right stick. You can do it standing still, that will count as a floater, or you can do it moving but don't hold right trigger or anything like that. And the way you run forwards or you're leaning backwards will vary how that floater is played. So you can just mess around with it in this environment. So where am I and how am I you know, accessing this? So I'll back out here, I'll just quit it and I'll show you exactly where you can learn how to do a floater and also many other things. We're sitting in 2KU. So if we go all the way back to the root menu, you'll find 2KU under play now jump into there and move to the right hand side and here is 2KU. Jump into the tutorial area and then in here you will find a set of tutorials. So read that, tells you what the buttons are if you're not on the Xbox, if you're on PlayStation or whatever. I'll dismiss that. Into shooting, uh, there is runner slash floater. So we select that move and then you're in exactly the same mode as I am here and you can learn to do floaters this way. Couple of other things about floaters, if you are playing against uh, other players, uh, you will find that if the defender comes close to you, so you're trying to fire off the floater, it gets harder to do this. You won't have a nice big green bar here. It'll get more and more contested. So what you want to be doing is moving away from people, using your dribble moves and practicing a lot in 2KU to create space, passing the ball to someone else and trying to create that space before you fire out the floater. But there you go, my friends. I don't want to waffle on too much. It's not that difficult to do a floater, but now you know how to do it. I hope that was useful. If it was, give us a thumbs up, please. It's much appreciated. If you need more help with NBA 2K24, do let me know with what. I'll do my best to help with a future video. And there's a playlist at the end of here that will help you out with other things in the game that I think are difficult or confusing in the game. So I hope that helps you out. If you like what I do, hit that subscribe, will you? Thanks so much.